And we're back, and that's not the news I wanted to see. Uh, well, not the news about Say being released, that's good, but uh, um, Gemini down 25% due to a test failure. The only good news that I think this is is, uh, is that downgrades by random event don't, I think, knock down your max R and D. Uh, we'll find out here in like two seconds. Uh, no, they don't knock down your max R and D, so it doesn't. It didn't drop it, drop the max R and D back down to that minimum, to the 86 percent. So we can research straight back to 88 uh, percent. Whether we, whether we'll succeed in doing so is another matter. Let's find out. No, only the 76. I'm not doing duration, um, a duration mission at 76 percent. So. This mission is scrubbed. Sorry, boys. Uh, it looks like the uh, orbiting pro the probes are gonna be out. Oh, sorry. Misclick, misclick, exit, pad C. Do that. Satellites are gonna be the name of the game this month. Um, what's the next thing? That's right. Say is in town, so, uh, yeah, know how low his stats are relatively? That's because he got injured during training. So, when he's out of training, he doesn't gain the skills, he just goes straight in. That's the same thing that happened to, um, who was that? Was that Cooper? No, that was Grissom. I think that was Grissom who was injured originally. But anyway, Gemini, let's see if I can make Crew 6. Was I right with Armstrong and Say? No, I was not. Like Divot and Say, though, are good. So Armstrong is all by his lonesome. Now, how likely are some of these people to retire? Glenn's down at 37, but he hasn't announced yet. Chris is at 42, and he hasn't announced yet. I'm just wondering... Yeah. I'm going to send Armstrong to advanced, um, what advanced training do I want to do? LM or docking, really, because I want another four. So advanced LM training. So he goes there, so we can facility transfer, and he is now in advanced training for LM. So... That's an odd thing. If I go to an advanced, if I go to any of the training things, I have to click first to p stop the video before I can actually hit the continue button. Anyway, okay, so we have 93 MBs left, and we're in the spring. What I'm gonna do now is I need to buy some stuff because I'm half thinking I'm gonna have to take Gemini to the moon if I'm gonna have any chance to beat the Soviets. Even if I don't, if I'm going to use the Apollo later on, I'm going to need something to get off the ground and our stock Titan is not going to do. So we're going to buy our booster program. Like I said earlier, plus 800 to our max payload. So we purchase it, we start at 30% because of tech transfer. And we research it for two per team. We won't bother, we won't use the boosters right now, we're good. Yeah, but, you know, in a year and a half, two years, it'll be important. The other thing we absolutely have to purchase right now is we have to purchase a docking module. Docking modules are important, and they are the bane of your existence. Without a docking module program, you can't do any steps that involve actual docking of spacecraft. So, any way, go, any way of going to the moon, apart from direct ascent, you will need... A do you will need to have some a docking step, and the docking step uh, check is dependent on the safety factor of the docking module. So we got to start that. The problem is, note, ma note maximum R and D is double dash, and if you visit the R and D facility, it tells us we cannot research the docking module at all. The only way to improve the docking module safety factor is to actually use it in docking tests. 
at 5% for a failed test and 10% for a successful test, up to the maximum of 93%. This is not fortuitous. Um, so what we'll do is we'll hold off on more astronauts for now. We'll probably get them in the spring of next year, though. Uh, since Gemini is so low, it was at 70-something, right? Okay. So we've got two unmans this turn. So next turn we will do our, um... Duration C Gemini mission. Uh, and we'll do same cruise as we were going to do before. Uh, Young Grissom primary, Borman and Glenn's backup. Knowing I have to probably spend 10 on the boosters and 10 on the uh, Gemini, that's about all I can really afford to do. I was thinking maybe of doing a joint unmanned docking test with Gemini. Uh, but, that'll, but I think that will have to wait until the spring of 66. So we'll save the 47 MBs just in case we get another bad event. We got our Venus and Lunar flybys to do. So let's get them going. To Venus! Yes, yes. No. No, that's not good. Yep, so now we get the, what, minus three for a failed Venus flyby. Although Titan did get a plus one percent, which is good. And we shouldn't have any penalties on the Lunar flyby because we've already done one successfully. Yep, planetary activities is good, so we get two prestige back. Good evening, developments in the news today. A new space game makes its debut in Hollywood. Both realistic and entertaining, it's expected to inspire the public while educated. And that's the news. About, what, 25, 30 years too early for Buzz Aldrin Jackson's in the space? Also, yeah, even though Slayton is a high morale, they can randomly decide to retire anyway. In this case, for personal reasons. What that means is, let's go to our Gemini. Slayton's name is now in... Black? I've heard someone say this is like a navy blue, but it's like a black, at least on my screen. Which is an indication just to let you know that this is a person who has announced they are going to retire. And it's usually two or three seasons after they announce then they will then they will retire. When that happens, Cooper will be removed from the flight crew because the crew will be broken by Slayton's retirement. So I have to make sure that if we that if we put them on a flight, then we have to have a backup crew just in case. Uh, anyway, we'll uh, research up Gemini. A good thing I picked ten, and we got fifteen percent on that. Ten on the boosters. The sixty-six. We'll assemble our Gemini four mission. It's interesting, you know, historically, uh, yeah, historically we were right, well, I think we're right on, actually no, that's only because we had the scrub. It was Gemini 3 last, last season, it's Gemini 4 this season. So, never mind that point, that point was, uh, point less. So, what I will do is, uh, let's see, I'll cut the video here. Oh wait, we don't have any future missions scheduled. Um, yeah, that's not good, right? Okay, yeah, that's bad. Um, I'll cut the video here, and I'll be back, and we'll do the future missions, and we'll do the launch, and we'll be through the end of uh, uh, the end of 1965. So later.